five things are on. Yeah. Um, power five, so we did the yeah. business. Power five got the autonomy. Uh, yeah. Any changes that you would like to see? In the system? Yes, I think actually that's great. Uh, you know, a lot of the issues that you hear about all the time could have been solved earlier had they had this position. Uh, it all makes sense uh, to eventually do this because now those teams in bigger schools with more money, frankly, can do more for student athletes, which is, you know, on the table is probably the biggest top, hot topic in the off season. So, you know, it, it was being held back like that. Everybody knows about that the cost of uh, attendance stipend that was passed and then rescinded. And that was simply rescinded because the majority of everybody in Division One couldn't afford it. But had it been now, with the autonomy of five conferences, it would have passed for sure. So that's kind of that's the kind of thing you're looking at. And uh, so I think it, you know, as I've looked at it, uh, nobody necessarily asked me, but I've looked at it for the last couple of years. I I thought it was inevitable. Uh, part of the committee, 15 players. Uh, you have one vote. Who's the player on this team that you're voting for? For that committee? If you, hypothetically, of course. Isaac to, Samuel to be, to be on the committee from this team. Isaac said Sean would be the best guy. Who would you say? Yeah. You know, I think it would be, you know, Sean Doctor. You know, uh, it might be uh, Teron Alexander. I don't know. <laughs> Usual suspect. <laughs> I, uh, I've got so many guys, Stephen. I'm not going to single out anybody. Uh, I've got lots of seniors that are very, very conscious of, uh, and aware of all the issues. So. Second day in shells, just how would you assess how today went overall? Good. We did uh, much more team, more skelly today. Uh, so it's the interaction of football is good for this early.